In the winter when I'm saying, oh man, I wish it was colder. Oh, it was hot this weekend. Definitely was, but it was nice to be outside. I'm happy to see the warmer temperatures. It really was. Yeah, you know, some folks are like, ah, it's a little bit too hot. And, you know, we're kind of not Including used me. to it, too. If the yesterday yeah. was a July day, we'd be like, okay, this is manageable. Yes. But it wasn't. It's in May. That was so. the trick. Yes, absolutely. Taylor, to your point, right? You know, like talking about the winter time, it's like we, we long for these days, these warm, humid days. But I think the days we long for are more so the day that we're going to have today and tomorrow. Just delightful out there. Much cooler and drier. We're down to 46 degrees now in Springfield after that high yesterday of 87. And, of course, the dew points yesterday were up over 60. Now they're down into the lower 40s. So much cooler and drier out there. Temperatures in greater Springfield are 50 or cooler right now. Well, West Springfield at 51. But you get the picture here. Much more comfortable. 48 in Amherst right now. 47 in Belchertown, lower 40s from Charlemont over to North Adams. So you can certainly shut off the fans and ACs today, open up the windows, let in some of that nice refreshing air. We are running 15 to 25 degrees cooler right now compared to yesterday at this time. Going for a morning jog, it is absolutely delightful weather for it, near perfect conditions, upper 40s right now, not much wind. Sun came up or comes up this morning at 521. Kids heading off to the bus stop a little later. They may even need the light jacket. They'll need the sunglasses as well. Low to mid 50s by about 8 o'clock or so, and by this afternoon, we're between 70 and 75 degrees. It'll be dry, nice and delightful today. Gorgeous day. Got up to 90 on Saturday, 87 yesterday. Nowhere near record highs. Record high for Saturday's date, 96. Record high for yesterday's date. Happened to be an all-time May record high of 101. So certainly can get warm this time of year. We did just, in fact, do that over the weekend. And now it's cooler and drier to start the week. Today and tomorrow look delightful. Heat and humidity come back for one day, for Wednesday. It's going to be short-lived, but it could bring cold front could bring some showers and thunderstorms in the afternoon and evening. Behind it, it's still warm Thursday, but less humid. And then the cooler air comes in here for Friday and for the start of this upcoming weekend. So temperatures are going to be all over the place the next several days. Right where they should be for this time of year, today and tomorrow. Hot, humid on Wednesday. Drier on uh, Thursday. Cooler, too. And then look at Friday and Saturday. We could see temperatures in the 60s for highs with perhaps a few showers around at that point. Your satellite and radar composite showing mainly clear skies now. Just a few thin clouds out there. All the moisture getting suppressed off to the south as high pressure has worked its way in. So for today, a lot of sunshine around. A few thin clouds. Nice and delightful out there today. Clear, cool tonight. A couple of clouds build in tomorrow afternoon mixed with the sunshine. We're still dry tomorrow. Middle and upper 70s. Warm front could bring a shower tomorrow night into Wednesday morning. And then the cold front will arrive in the afternoon. But out ahead of it, we briefly get hot and humid on Wednesday. Then the front moves through and it does eventually turn cooler and drier for the end of this upcoming week. There's a chance we could have a few strong to severe storms on Wednesday. Storms Prediction Center on that one to five scale puts us on a one in terms of the severe weather. That's something we'll be watching probably mid afternoon Wednesday. And as we go into the evening, dew points were near 60 yesterday. Today, tomorrow, dew points are in the 40s. They'll spike on Wednesday out ahead of the cold front, and then we dry it right back out for Thursday, Friday, and as we head on to this upcoming weekend. So it's really only one hot, uncomfortable day out of the next probably week or so. And, of course, that's coming in on Wednesday with temperatures perhaps up near 90 degrees as well. So checking out your next seven. There it is. Delightful today and tomorrow. Hot and humid Wednesday. Late day showers and storms. Still warm Wednesday. I should say Thursday, still warm Thursday, but it's a lot less humid and that cooler air is draining. It'll be with us for Friday and Saturday, perhaps in the 60s with some shower chances, particularly on Friday. Still kind of an early call for the weekend, uh, whether or not we get any rain on the weekend, maybe a few showers on Saturday. The weekend is setting up, though, to be much cooler, perhaps temperatures running below normal for the uh, long holiday weekend. All right, more on the forecast coming up in a few minutes. Jordan and Taylor, back to you. Thank you, Dan.